Now, what may look on the surface here like a very pretty regular gatefold card actually opens out to be a double size crazy concertina fold card. So it looks like a normal gatefold, then you see the surprise inside. And actually you can be decorating the different panels of these to be anything you want. I'm just going to teach you here how to do the basic construction. So put that to one side. What we're going to do is start off with two sheets of cardstock which you need to cut to 12 inches by 8 inches, okay? So they look like a sheet of A4 but they're not quite. So 12 inches by 8 inches. We're going to start placing it against the box lid side and I want you to score at 2 inches and then 4 inches. Miss out six, I want you then to go at eight and ten, okay? Turn it right around, okay? And then I want you to go, not all the way, but just starting at the end of the first panel, down to the end of the second panel on two inches. And again, I want you to come in two inches from this side and just score down there, okay? Now that, believe it or not, is the scoring done. So I'll put the board to one side, bring in my cutting mat. What you need to do is with a, a knife, just cut down this central part of both sides. Then I'm going to start and fold and burnish. So fold and burnish. Fold this one and burnish. But then actually the trick to this is that you end up folding it back on itself. So fold the first one and burnish. And again fold. Burnish those folds. Okay. Then what I'm going to do is just fold one back on itself and then fold the other the opposite way again, okay? Just make sure that folds right into place. And it just takes a little bit of manoeuvring, the fold here, okay? But you can see how we are creating half of the crazy concertina. Now, you need to make two of these, okay? So I've got two crazy concertinas, and what you'll see is they're actually mirror images of each other, right? So if I open them back out and make sure, so there we go, so I'm taking the mountain fold, then the valley. If we're taking the outside, we're coming with the valley fold, then the larger mountain, okay? Now, what you need to do, first of all, and this is very similar to a, one of the projects that we do on the, the Ultimate Christmas DVD, actually, whereby you make the same card twice and then do the joins in the centre. I'm going to join up the centre part here, so I'm going to just pop a bit of uh, double-sided tape using our really, really strong tape pens. I'm going to lie that on there. I'm going to stick, if I actually use the grid lines on the uh, board here, which should help. And then stick this panel over the front. And then do the same over the back. stick with, with the Centura Pearl side down this time so that the back all looks like one ginormous card. Then to extend the front panels and to make it into an actual full gatefold, I mean that makes a nice shaped card 
on its own. But to take it to the next level, what you need to do, if I bring the board back in, is I've taken two sheets of cardstock cut to eight inches by six inches. And I'm just going to score each of them at two inches in. Okay. Again, folding and burnishing here. So then to create my gatefold, just put the tape on this side here. And this just glues under this first panel here. It just covers up all of my card inside and then the same here put the tape on and then that is just going to go underneath the front here and the card literally takes just a few minutes to do and is ready for you to decorate however you choose regular gatefold crazy concertina card mm -hmm.